finish your chips. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to send this in, aren't you? Hey? You're going to send this in, aren't you? These are going to be the best bits. Oh, no. So, we're here, sat in my car, in as far north as we could possibly get, to, which is actually Leamington Spa, which is still actually quite posh, to wish Yorkshire St Pauli a happy fifth birthday. Happy fifth birthday. Happy fifth birthday. And now what? Why do you like St Pauli, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like them because who? What? St Pauli or Yorkshire St Pauli? St Pauli first. St Pauli first. Oh, I don't know. I get asked this question a lot. I should have an answer already. I like them because they because they play in brown. I knew you were going to say that. Why? Because you like brown. <laughs> but did I like brown first, or did I like Yorkshire St Pauli? No, I, I think you were a beige man first, but you graduated to brown. Okay. We, got, we mustn't talk like like we're talking to the camera. I don't want that bit in there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we like more just like a casual conversation. So when did you first meet Yorkshire St Pauli, Nick? Um, I think I first actually met Scott and Luke outside the Jolly Roger with the guys from Catalonia and there was some pretty dodgy deal involving cherry drops and a membership card. I think I secured my membership for two cherry drops, which probably makes me as big a corporate fraud as David Cameron's dad. Can we say that? Yeah, we can. I think. Well, no, because he hasn't broken any laws. It's just morally wrong. And yeah. so basically we stood outside the Jolly, we were chatting, we had some cherry jobs and I got a membership card and I thought they were a really nice um, a group of lads and then we just kept bumping into each other. And I Where? <laughs> what do you think? In St Pauli, in Hamburg. Okay. And sometimes in Dusseldorf when we played there. Okay. Where they were in the seats and I was in the terrace and I waved them. What about you? I honestly can't remember. <laughs> I have no recollection of when I first met them. All right. Was it? Did it involve beanbags? No, I think that was later. Beanbags were later. Mm. I think I just met them through you. Like I meet all my friends, so I don't, <laughs> I don't actually meet anyone by myself. Thanks, what, what do you like about them? <clears throat> it's nice to be with like-minded people who uh, care about things and want to make a difference. Not that I make much of a difference, but it's nice to be associated with people who do. Um, and I guess feel quite comfortable when we meet up with them and have a chat and play football in the right spirit, which I always do. And um, yeah, I just really, really enjoy meeting up with them. It's just a shame we live so far away, I guess. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm eternally grateful that they've taken on a two southerners. I don't, know, I don't know whether you're southern or not, or you're from Cornwall, so like you're the extremities. But it's, I, I think it's part of... Obviously, you guys do a lot of good work. The, the football for all is fantastic. The, you know, the support for refugees that you do in, in Leeds is brilliant. And I absolutely admire you for all of that. And I think you're probably the most active um, uh, St Pauli fan group if in the UK, definitely, if not outside of Germany. So I think you deserve massive credit for that. The work that you guys put on is fantastic. Um, and like, like I said, take, that inclusivity is extended to taking on two idiots with long hair and uh, unhealthy, interesting corduroy. So, favourite memory of stuff you've done with, with YSP? When do we get to do the Wayne's World bit? There's a lot of... Um, I, it's hard to pick out just just, just one thing. Cause I, You're so earnest. I do enjoy the uh, dancing and singing on the terraces a lot. <laughs> <laughs> that's, no, that's something to be enjoyed. I enjoy that too. And... He laughed at that, but I've, I'm not laughing I really at enjoy it. that. I'm just laughing at it I as really, an answer. I really enjoy that side of it. I enjoy the the whole trip, right from start to finish, the adventure, um, which it always is, with someone not turning up or not having tickets or too many tickets or not enough tickets or whatever happens. Uh, I do like the atmosphere. I like just being able to be myself with a group of people who have similar Are you, are you similar striking your own leg there? Yeah. yeah. Cool nerves. But what what about what about YSP memories? I enjoy the tournaments a lot. I wish I was a bit better at them, but um Hey we won one of them. <laughs> and I love that that to be honest, that's the best football trophy I've ever won. That first tournament tro plate trophy. It's just a work of art and we've got one each and yeah, it's one of my favourite things. One of my favourite things ever 
um, in football. There you go. Right up there with the Adidas Tango from the 1982 World Cup. <sighs> We're waffling a bit. What else do we like? We like... Uh... Like a mojito at the end of the night, which we normally ends up with whenever we're out with St. Pauli. Um, oh, hang on. Um, oh, what have I done to Oh, it? no, your battery hasn't gone, has it? I think so. No. It hasn't. I think it's we're just. We're, we're okay. Panic over. We're starting the car. And we've got light again. I'll, um, I'll stop the car. We that also. Would be uh, illegal in some way. What about like official YSP memory? Best thing that's happened with them? Sondershug. Yeah, it's got to be. It's got to be up there. I don't like sleeping much, so it really suits me. <laughs> and um, yeah, it's just a laugh from start to finish. Yeah, and I think to... it, even Nick stayed up late for us that night because yeah. normally he's in bed about ten and the um, on a, with a couple of shandies. So you you were honoured for Nick to stay out about past. I've that got time. to say that Sondershug last year was absolutely incredible. I love seeing everybody getting back on the train and the dancing primarily from this guy over here was incredible. I loved it um, when he queued outside the D <laughs> DJ booth for at least three quarters of an hour. Convinced he was next in line for the toilets. That was, was a highlight. Line, wasn't it? Um, and I also loved it when he tripped, when he, well, when he fell off the train and thank you Fuzz for saving yeah, him. Yeah, I do. I used to still a drink for that Fuzz because that, that could have been the end of my dancing Defying career. the laws of physics and showing some superhuman <laughs> capacity you managed to stop him, a man probably three or four times your weight, <laughs> At least from, four. from from slipping dangerously down between the train and the platform. So that was a highlight. Um, so stuff like that is just in, it, amazing. The beanbag night with Scott was good uh, in the fan yeah. round. That was a good one. It's kind of the first time he sort of... It was unexpected that night. Yeah, it was good. It was a really good one. I uh, guess a lot of unexpected things happen and we're very grateful for that. Yeah. But to wrap it up, are we wrapping it up? Can we do? Can we do Wayne's World? Or are we not allowed no. to? Oh. No. <laughs> the whole thing of sitting in the car doing this, so we could do no, Wayne's, World. Wayne's World. So anyway, happy birthday! Um, I can't believe it's five years. It's amazing. Well done. Have a great party on the. Uh, it's the weekend before we we go out for the final game. So I hope the tournament goes well. Sorry we won't be there. I'm hoping to pop in. Oh, are you now? Just very quickly. <laughs> I'm driving back from Newcastle. Okay. And I'm going to drop in, hopefully, very for a brief. Appearance and say hello to everyone. Nice. I'm just sorry I can't play in the tournament. Okay. Well, well done to everyone because you you just worked so hard and it's a, a genuine inspiration. I know we're sort of being a bit stupid sitting in the car doing this, but it's such a decent bunch of people working for all the right causes, and it's really good to be associated with you. So thank you. All thank right. You. That's it. What about Wayne's World in the dark? <laughs> Why not? They'll never know. <laughs> no, not do that.